In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you one of my secret little adjustments to make the PA All Cross that much more powerful against Cover 3 and Cover 4, really to force your opponent to have to play some type of Cover 2 on the short or on the uh, tight end side of the field. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this video. If you're new to the channel, make sure that you subscribe. It's completely free to subscribe and what my channel does is we basically post videos every single day that are designed to help you become a better Madden player in Madden 21. So if you're looking to get better at this game, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. It is completely free. Now, before we dive too deep into the day's video, one of the things that I wanted to talk about really quickly is um, my Bunch Tight End Offensive eBook. Now, I'm going to be giving you a free sample today. This play is one play out of several plays that you would get um, and out of several breakdowns that you would get if you picked up the Bunch Tight End eBook. Um, the Bunch Tight End, in my personal opinion, is the best offense in the game. And so you can pick up the eBook right now for just $15. It is a great way to support me and my community here on YouTube. It's also a great way for you to be able to learn some of the tools and some of the strategies that I believe are in this playbook, this game plan. It's a full offensive game plan. shows you everything that you need to know to execute at a very, very high level um, with the Bunch Tight End Offense. We show you game plays, film studies, depth charts, everything that you need to be successful. So if you want to get that full ebook, that is available in the description for just 15 bucks. And if you have any questions about it, just hit me up via text message. My number is in the top left-hand corner of your screen. Okay, guys, so we're going to be talking today about the play PA All Cross. And one of my favorite little strategies here, um, a lot of people like to run cover four. A lot of people like to like to almost even run some match coverage and things like that. But what I like to do here is I'm just going to streak the tight end. I'm going to put Tavon Austin on a slant route. And then I'm going to double team this guy so that I can get out of the pocket. And then basically you're going to see just like this. I mean, it, it, th this is the setup. It's very simple. The biggest thing that I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to motion Devontae Adams to the right side of the formation. Okay. Now, if you wanted to, you could put the tight end on a delay fade. Uh, I'm going to show you two different ways to do this. But the first way is this. And this is really good because people don't expect this motion right here. But what's also really good is this crossing route still gets to about, um, I think it's about 15 to 20 yards. And so it almost acts like a corner route, basically, in the way that it works. So let me show you, um, let me show you like cover three. And we have our flats shaded to about 20, 25 yards, kind of a, a standard shade um, as far as zone drops goes. And if you watch this corner route right here, um, he does a really, really good job because he's not on really a corner route. He's on a crossing route. And what you'll notice is that the flat zones don't really react to him if they are inside of him. So when it, it comes back to that idea of leverage. So if he has leverage on the defender, um, he is going to be able to consistently work. This is really, really effective, especially if you're on the left side hash mark and you're running this to the wide side of the field. I wouldn't do it the other direction. But if you're running this on the short side, you'll see here, by the time you get rolled out, it's wide open. That's against cover four. Outside quarter doesn't play it. And the flat zone doesn't play it. Now, another thing that you can do with this is you can run it without a streak. So if you don't want to use a streak, that's fine. Um, you're just going to leave Tunyon on his delay fade there. And then we're going to motion this out. We've got a post right on the back end of this. But if you watch what happens here, now you'll see it still is going to get open because the crossing route is such a unique little cut. Now, what's really cool about this is let's say that you have... And we all know that we want to make sure that Devontae, uh, you know, whoever we are have in that position, um, we want this to be our best route runner. So whoever is in the triangle or the Y position on Xbox, that's who you want to be your best route runner. So you're going to motion the triangle receiver over, and then you'll see right here against man coverage, all you're doing is you just pass lead it up, and it's an absolute laser. As you can see right there, that route tech just activates, and he's able to get open. It's one of the best uh, routes in the game. So how are they going to stop this? Well, the best way for them to be able to stop this is to try to go to some type of cover two to have the cloud flats on the outside so that they can have good leverage. Now, what I want to show you is that does not always stop it. So again, you're going to get out of the pocket, rolling out, rolling out, rolling out, and you're just going to basically um, pass lead him open. If the flat zone is underneath, you're going to pass lead him up. If your pass, if your if your uh, flat zone is over the top, then you're going to pass lead him 
you're you're going to pass lead him outside. Um, so you'll see right here again, and you're just it's just it's basically a read. I mean, you're you're just looking out here, say okay, and then maybe I can you know I can low ball that to Devonte Adams. Another thing that you you know again cover two is the best way to stop this. The beauty of this though is like let's say they're running a lot of cover two on you, then what you can do is you can you can obviously adjust that right um you you can obviously adjust your play a little bit maybe you motion over the square receiver which is an automatic touchdown if they run cover two on on this this square receiver or the x receiver on xbox you're going to see if they run any kind of cover two it doesn't matter how much they've shaded it's a one play touchdown every single time so this forces the defense to run a defense that is going to get them screwed um that's that's kind of practically how it's how it's going to work so um that's the beauty of this offense this offense really puts the defense in a hard position um let's say that they ran like cover two um quarters uh which is basically where they put the cloud flats in the zones but they don't have a deep half they have a quarter zone you'll see that this crossing route um is going to get matched but now obviously you have your underneath route to Tavon austin so really really effective play does a really good job of beating man um one of my favorite things to do like let's say that they uh let's say that they're in cover zero right so let's say you're getting blitzed and they're shading underneath inside and underneath this is a great little tool because most people don't expect especially if you play bunch tight in a lot you don't expect this player to be on a cross like a corner cross, you expect him to be on a slant or something. And so what you'll see here is, let's say that they do that, just pass lead it up, and it's an absolute laser against man coverage. If they shade underneath, you are going to have answers for them. So this is a phenomenal, phenomenal play. It does really good against cover three, cover four, um, match coverage, against and against man coverage um the one play that i would say if you if they run cover two you still have reads you still have options with this but i just wanted you to see so so let me show you really quickly one last thing here um i didn't show a ton of mike blitz three so let me show you that real quick this is mike blitz three so this is an outside third on that side now and what you'll see is kind of the same you know kind of the same thing here again just hard outside pass lead you see even with deep out ko on jair alexander and acrobat it's not going to be able to stop it the cover three won't get out there that's the beauty of this of this play in my opinion um and it, it, it does such a good job um it's such a quick motion it's such a good leverage play you're, you're going to be able to get this out uh and get this out for a lot of yardage you see right there wide open uh that time we dropped it but uh very effective now another thing that you can do just just kind of one little th one last thing that i did want to hit on is let's say that you streaked both players and let's just say that for sake of the video that you uh you know let, let, let's just say you wheel the running back you flat circle or you you know what something like this right you do that again they're running mike blitz three you know cover three style and i just want you to watch how these routes work together but what you'll see is this this tight end up the seam is going to be open for a one play touchdown against cover three if you use the streak um so you know again a lot of spacing that you can get with the bunch tight end it's very very hard to consistently stop this offense um even in cover two if you were to do the same thing that i just said um if you were to do the same thing out of a cover two defense just want to show you what it looks like here um you know again and you have like an out route or something but when you do this, you're going to see this tight end up the seam is super, super open. So that's another thing that you have going for you with this offense. But there's so much that I want to share with you. I want to share it with you in the ebook. So if you haven't picked up the ebook yet, I really would encourage you to do it. It's literally just 15 bucks. Um, if you have any issue with that, just let me know via text message. But I think this offense is going to help you become a very, very good offensive player in this game. So bunch tight end, by far my favorite offense. If you have any questions about the ebook or if you want to get a free sample uh, of the ebook, just text me. My number is 812-216-3644. You'll never get a message that is not personally written from me. That's kind of my commitment to you guys with the text messages. Um, 
and it is my personal cell phone number. I don't have uh, the ability to take a lot of phone calls on there because I get a ton of phone calls. I would just ask that you please just text me. Um, that's the easiest way for you to get a response and for you to get what you need. So thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it. And again, if you want to get the full ebook, it's just for 15 bucks and it's in the description of this video. So thanks for your time. I really appreciate it. And we will see you guys on stream tonight at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time.